Hi and welcome to Robert's Country Cooking. Tonight I have fried up some chicken here. And I'm going to be using my avocado that I made earlier to put on our chicken sandwiches. I don't know if you've heard of that before, but that is a very healthy way to use our avocado on chicken. I don't know if you've ate it, but try it out. But before I get the video started, if you will make sure to subscribe, turn all notif notifications on. Um, that would be very helpful for me. Um, that helps the YouTube algorithm for me as well. Um, also, if you would check out my videos and give them a like, I would be greatly appreciated to do that as well as comment. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and get started. This is not very hard at all. We're just going to make us a chicken sandwich uh, this evening. Or this morning, actually, because it's one eleven, but that doesn't matter. <laughs> we eat kind of late here sometimes. Okay, so what I'm going to do is stick that on that chicken. Y'all saw that, right? That's when it's early. That's when stuff like that happens. But anyhow, let's see. Uh, I'm going to pit mayo on the top pan up here. I'll put mayo on the top crown and on the bottom crown is why I'm going to add the guac because you want the chicken that's hot sitting on top of that because it makes it taste good. Okay, so get that done. I'm going to move over here and I'll go grab this one. All you're doing is basically throwing the mayonnaise, listen to me, I was right, the mayonnaise on the crown. Set this over here. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going. Do you want a lot of guacamole or? No, not a lot. Like that? Yeah, I didn't want a lot of mayo either. Okay, he just wants a little bit of guacamole. I like mine loaded. Okay, and then I'm gonna put guacamole on mine. I hope y'all don't think this sounds weird, ain't guacamole on a chicken sandwich, but y'all try it. It's actually good. And it's healthy for you. For you. Nothing wrong with that. If you notice a lot of the burgers today, they have their, uh, they have guacamole on them, which is actually pretty cool. And then after that, just take your cheese, go up on top of them. We like just to eat simple stuff here at the house. Um, I don't want no kind of ketchup on mine. I got ketchup sitting here just for looks, you guys. So I'm going to take this and throw it in the sink over here. And let me go ahead and crown this sandwich. How many of those... Uh -oh. How many of those you can eat these with french fries, they're actually better. Let's these. Let's make some cute guys. If you go to store, uh, like, store or whatnot, usually it's they're really thick. You put a skewer through them. Look at how tall those are. Oh my goodness. That's too, that's too tall. Anyhow, um, let me do something real quick. I'm gonna snip them off. Cause those are too big. There we go. If they're too big guys, just get a sharp pair of scissors after them and just go cut, yeah. So no wood on the food. Cause they're extremely sharp in the scissors. And I was going to cook fries with these, but I decided not to. And you really don't have to. So just... I'm going to need some chips tonight. Just eat like a plain cook with them. Like that. Do that one. And I'm going to do this one. Dave, you can't mess up with these. I'm gonna get them everywhere, though, y'all. 
that they behind me over here. Sorry about that, you guys. <clears throat> and that is your finished product. And that is what your two sandwiches will look like. And Doug is about to do a short. And when he is done, I'm going to eat with him. So give us a couple of seconds. And like I said, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And uh, also make sure to turn on your notifications. So like when I make a video, you'll know that my videos on air or whatever, or that's been posted to YouTube. And I thank you very much for supporting the channel. This will be my last video for tonight. And uh, thank you very much. And thank I thank all my fans for being here with me and watching my videos and supporting us. And we'll talk to you later. Until then, God bless you and have a good night.